Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Evolution, the World of Sacred Device. I'm Nye, and hoping we finish this dungeon soon is Mako. It it just never stops. It doesn't. We're on floor 17. Oh, I found a dice. I don't know what it does, but I found one. Chances are it increases uh, luck. I'm assuming it is an accessory that increases luck by a crap ton. Improves gambling luck, huh? You know what? Gray, you're gonna use that. That's finally something to replace that item you have. I think six... You know what? I'm willing to... I'm willing to wager... Haha, <laughs> I'm funny. I'm willing to wager that, um... That luck is percentage of crit hits. Hmm. I'm not guaranteed on that. But I think it's percentage that you'll get a crit hit. So I think by increasing Gray's luck to 62, we should have a roughly 62% chance that Gray will critically hit anytime he hits. And that seems worth it to me. So far, though, he's, he's hit twice with no crit, so I might be wrong. But uh, I'm willing to try. <coughs> now that's three and no crit hit, so I might be wrong. But, I mean, I don't think I'm going to miss too much him not getting 30 health back every time he shoots. Considering enemies are doing five or 600 damage every time they hit. Yeah. Do I have any, uh... Let's see. Nope. I do not have any special items. So we're doing this floor blind. As usual. Shouldn't be a big deal, though. Item. Hello! Mag, please enjoy. Holy moly. <laughs> Mag is getting ridiculous again. Actually, I should replace his spray parts because I never use them because I can get at least another five uh, attack power out of that. Well, you were you were reluctant to get rid of them a little while ago, but... But that's because I was getting rid of them for... Um, I wasn't getting rid of them for more attack. I was getting rid of them for evasion. And that's a bit different. I was losing attack to get rid of spray parts. If I get spray parts, or if I drop the spray parts now, I'm gaining five attack. So, hmm. I'm not really losing anything, because I don't use any of those skills. You might put... Uh, since things are hitting so hard, you could probably put on that uh, defense parts you have found. Don't think it's worth it, to be honest. Like, yeah, enemies are hitting pretty hard, but they haven't been hitting that hard. And we have the evasion booster. If it was a defense part that was bigger, like if it was, say, a 30 defense, I might consider it. But, I don't know, right now, 5 attack is more worth, in, worth it than, than uh, losing 10 attack to gain 15 uh, defense. I'm min-maxing, leave me alone. <laughs> Let's see. No, I'm not even min-maxing. I'm just saying let's stack let's stack attack power. Saying I'm min-maxing is insulting min-maxing. Damn, no items in this one. We're getting less and less items with every uh, floor. That's because the game's getting more and more desperate to murder you. <laughs> it is! And notice that we all have maximum FP. Like, we're all up there in FP right now. And yet, in two fights' time, you won't have enough. It's a possibility. No, but then Linear... Well, then Gray will give FP to Linear, is what will happen. Because he has that skill now. Or well, he will have that skill. And then if Linear runs out again, she'll steal some from Gray. <coughs> it's like a feedback loop. It is! It's a, feed, it's a total feedback loop. Actually, I'm wondering how much TP it gives. Because what if... Linear feeds Gray TP, and then Gray feeds Linear TP, or FP. I'd like to say that they probably thought of that, but all things being equal, they probably didn't. Or they probably intended it. I've seen stupider things in a game. That would imply cleverness in the programmer's part, and I'm not sure I'm willing to believe that. It depends on what programmers. For instance, uh, if you play, you play Golden Sun, right? Mm-hmm. Okay, Golden Sun 1. 
it's possible to get all the way to at least the desert without picking up Mia, the girl who gives you Frost. It's because of this, and because the developers did not want to force you to pick her up, they gave you a Frost gem to make sure you had access to that synergy. Hmm. There are very good cases of the developer thinks of everything out there. You just gotta look for them. There's some really intelligent developers out there that want you to be able to do stupid stuff. Maybe not degenerate stuff like I'm planning on doing, but... <laughs> Remember, I want Mag dealing a thousand damage with basic attacks. And we're not actually that far off right now. Let's see, what can I get rid of? I, I, I'm almost certain that that the things that you have been putting to you have been making him do have got to be illegal in some places. Quite possibly, in this tower at least. I'm sure all the monsters aren't appreciating it. Yes, but they don't get any say in the matter. Exactly. Nobody cares what monsters have to say. Any other skills I want to unlock while we're uh, in combat? That's a heal. Let's just leave that. And. Yeah, we're just going to hold on to those. Okay. How about you, Linear? That's a, a full, uh, full heal. Now, I can't use all of these in any given combat, unfortunately, because we're reaching a point where any given skill I unlock is go is like six thousand or like three to 6,000 uh, TP. So I can't just have... No, I can't unlock both of them during a boss fight, so I'm going to have to decide wh what skill I want to unlock during this next boss fight. It's going to be a once per... Yeah. And so the final skills I unlock in these characters is going to be during the final boss, actually. That's what it's looking like. And I hate to say it, folks, if you're really enjoying this series, uh, Evolution 1, at least, is getting close to ending. Uh, the next dungeon is the last one. That's not to say it's been a short game. I mean, it really isn't, but when you kind of know what you're doing, I guess it goes by a lot faster. Well, this has been a fairly small floor. Got an item over here. Oh. Give me it. Flaming wrap, don't care. Uh, let's go fight this monster. I can't see it. Oh, there it is. <laughs> as soon as my blindness comes up. Oh, right! Uh, nope. All the nope. Nope and nope. Goodbye. Not dealing with this. Okay, I'm kind of hoping the next floor is the, fo is the boss. Because all my stats are at full, so it'd be kind of nice to go in with just, like full stats across the board. That would be nice, but... Definitely be pleasant. I don't know. Previous experiences said... Yeah, I mean, we're probably going up to floor 20. But it's a possibility. Shame. Oh well. We'll go punch this guy. Damn. <laughs> I hate it when the monsters get to attack before I do. Ow. Don't do that. That hurts. Do I want to squish this? Yes. I want to squish this. That's how I decided to play. We're just going to squish this. Now, you gotta remember, uh, Magna Combo costs 64 FP now. Sheesh. Well, we're gonna get to use it five times on Mag. Roughly. No, I don't want that. But yeah, we're gonna get to use it about five times. I'm curious if this boss will actually survive that. You're, you're counting, like, attack boosts and FP cons conservation skills in there, or...? Nope. Guts Bandana, we want that. I recall that being really good. Hey, I think that's for Gray, too. Yep. Let's see. Increases defense by a lot, agility by a lot. Luck goes down again. But uh, I think I can live with that for that defense boost and uh, agility boost. Oop, new enemy type, I think. We got the drop on them, too. Ooh, a mechaphage. Oh, oh, oh. Those are, those are like the metal slimes. Is this a bad thing or a good thing? 
You never played Dragon Quest? Nope. Never mind, uh, they're worth they're worth like shit tons of experience. Oh wow, yeah they are. Huh. The catch is the catch is that the moment they see you they run away, so Ah. I'm glad I snuck up on that one then. But yeah, they're they're worth tons and tons of experience. And yeah. they can show they can show up anywhere. Oh, okay. I think that's probably the first time I've ever seen one. So that should say something. Oh. <laughs> smack you. You smack you. Oh well. I didn't exactly attack the exact right way. For some reason, Mag is not getting his uh, third attack in anymore. Hmm. So enemies are getting faster. Which is not necessarily a bad thing. This means I can't kill the enemies before they get a chance to move. Like, think about chance that in real time, for though. You, but less chance for uh, one turn. Yeah. Well, I mean, just think about that in terms of, like, actual real time. What we were doing earlier is Mag was moving at basically light speed, attacking a bunch of enemies, and Gray was firing off multiple shots a second with a uh, bolt-action rifle. I almost want to make a celerity joke, but I can't think of a good one. <laughs> also, I have no idea how many people would actually get it. <laughs> Probably not. And Gray just said something as he dodged that. But I don't know what. Also, squish. Given I have several ways to get Mag more FP in case I want to continue raving at the at the enemy's face, just <laughs> I don't really care right now. Okay, we cannot carry any more items. Uh, actually, you know what? I will get an herb instead of an ice ball. So I'm probably never going to use that. It's just not high on my list of priorities. Okay. They're not even relatively saleable. I mean, I, I they could prob they probably do some level of damage, but question is, do they do more than Mag does? If no, then not worth it. You know? Oh, I okay. Applegrass is re if I remember correctly, really, really good. Like a really important rare item, Applegrass. A herb with an apple fragrance that restores 500 HP and FP to all friends. Oh, nice. I think you're intended to save that for the final boss. So I will. Because I don't uh, I don't want to lose that. That'd be important. Okay, I think I will heal during this one. Just so I can get everybody's health up. And, yeah. Linear's at max TP again. Mag's still at max TP. And uh, I believe Gray is at max as well. And uh, Pepper and uh, Chain have been back at base going, God damn it, we've been max TP for the past three episodes. What's wrong with you guys? Oh, uh, yeah. Hey, we're actually going to kill all these guys before they get a chance to move. Well, that's oh, wait, never mind. something that, that hasn't happened in a while. We almost did, but uh, Linear did not. No, we. Oh, never mind. Linear didn't get that extra move I was hoping for. Leave Gray alone. He's old. <coughs> well, you'll notice how he's shooting a gun as opposed to punching things. Even Linear is hitting things with a melee weapon. Gray's using a rifle. Okay, what, uh, let's see. How about we go up? What's up? I don't know. The longer we go down, the more, uh, looking like we might not <laughs> reach the end of this dungeon by the end of this episode. Oh, God. I know. It just won't it end. It just won't end. Well, there's an item. Trap search. I actually will probably want to pick that up in favor of an ice ball. 
talking about I'm not helping things by by full clearing out dunge every dungeon floor, but no, 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 you aren't. But I think it's necessary, honestly. Because otherwise, we're just gonna fall behind in a in level, and we don't want that. That would be bad. Falling behind in level would be very bad. Especially given the type of nonsense we're likely to encounter uh, in the final dungeon. Because I know the type of nonsense we encounter in the final dungeon. It's nonsense. Hello. Gimme. Brontosaurus steel. I don't know what that is, but it sounds nice. Gimme. It's a rare item again, isn't it? Brontosaurus steel? Not sure. We'll see. Uh, you know what? I didn't even see what I didn't even see the enemy when you before before you impacted it. Uh, it was sitting. I knew it was there. I was trying to get behind it. Didn't have a chance because it saw me as I picked up the treasure chest. It's another one of the eight-legged freaks. Okay, what is Brontosaurus steel? I'm assuming I'm assuming it's an appraisal item, but it could always be equipment. A steel ball that makes heavy thunderbolts cause lightning-based damage to all enemies. Well, I, apparently I was excited for nothing. It's another use item. Hmm. Might be a really good item, but it's another use item. How many enemies do we have? Just two. I was gonna e If it was four enemies, I was going to use it. But, you know what? Screw it. Oh, come on, Linear. It's fine. Uh, Gray can shoot. Gray doesn't have any problem attacking enemies. Gray likes hurting people. So does Mag. Mag likes hurting people too. Linear can just sit back there and wish that she was useful. I I'm sorry, Linear. That was mean. You're useful. Really. <laughs> Come on, you don't want to see Linear cry. Shit, that's not good. That's not good. Okay, where is the end? I think the exit to this floor was this hallway up here. Yep, there it is. Are there any items in it? Please? There's one. Damn it. What's in this? Minale and Royale? I will make room for that, because it's Minale and Royale. Um, you know what? I guess I'm going to use the Mokana Ampule on Nag. 19th floor. What do we got? Is this it? Nope. No, it is not. Got a thermo search. Well, I might as well use a thermo search if I'm going to pick one up. Oh, that's a trap search. Okay, I can live with that because that's going to give me basically a clue to where everything is. We're going to do a thermo search, which will basically tell me where all the enemies. No, tell me all the enemies are, which will basically tell me where all the uh, where everything else is. That's a not good thing. This is a teleporting enemy, which means it's one of these assholes. Got earlier, I had one of these I was chasing down. It teleported from one side of the room to the other, so I moved to the other side of the room, and before I reached the other side of the room, it teleported back. <coughs> I was kind of annoyed. But you were telling a story at the time, so I was so I didn't say anything. It was really annoying though. I was not exactly the happiest of campers. Dead. Linear should be able to kill that guy. Wonderful. Yay, we killed everybody before any enemy took a turn. That's how that's supposed to go. Really. We cannot carry more items. Mokana Ampule instead of. Um... Let's get rid of the shell frying pan. We don't need that anymore. There's nobody else who's frying pans except for Linear. Okay. That's a... That's gas. That's gas. That's an enemy drops in your head. Okay, we have a lone enemy floating around over here. So this is probably a room or a hallway. It's a hallway. Okay. It can only be one of... It can only be a room or a hallway. That's right. <laughs> There's nothing else it could possibly be. Okay, let's spread the damage out a little bit. And then if I do that, we should probably be able to kill all these guys before they get to take a turn. Just by 
kill one enemy at a time. That guy, there goes that guy. Linear, can you kill this thing? Nope. Yes. Okay. There's this delayed reaction between when she hits and when the thing dies, which is kind of... Kind of getting to me. Yeah, Linear's coming through. Yeah, she's pulling through for me. Consistently, too. Unlike that loser mag, who never gets kills. We found squishy sandals. Sure, what can I drop for him? Uh, we're gonna drop the hunting gun. Cause I don't need that. Which I, uh, that's a linear item. And they're not good, okay. What's in here? A broken psi frame, nice. Uh, I forget what that does, but I know it's something decent. We're gonna, actually I'm gonna keep the lucky frying pan. We're gonna drop the high heel shoes. And that is a good trap. Gray's something or other has increased. So that was a stat up trap. Which is always, always a welcome addition to my something or other. My collection traps. God damn it! I was trying to dodge it, but that doorway wouldn't let me. So we'll just randomly run around this hallway for a while. Having a seizure. <laughs> I just watched that one episode of Pokemon, apparently. Okay. Okay. Dodge all in that. Oh, crap, it's one of these. It's one of these. Quick, quick, get behind it. <laughs> I did it. Okay. Mag. Squish. Squish now. Squish all of them. Do it twice if you have to. Squish. This, this concerns me. These things are big. I hate these things. I'm lucky that the every time I fought these things, I've gotten the uh, I've gotten the initiative. But ugh, frightening. Mag couldn't squish them. That's frightening. I'm attacking the right one, right? Nope. Damn. Okay, that one's dead. Mag's still gonna take a thousand damage. Ah, these things are scary. They're dead. I swear, I don't think I've ever seen one of those in any of my other playthroughs. So they're they're incredibly frightening. <laughs> Something I've never fought before. And it's that big. And does that scary stuff. That's that's just you never want to see that. Let's let uh Gray do a squish this time. Because I would appreciate not having to fight all these enemies. I still love that Gray's just shaking as he does this. You know, he's just, you know, ugh, it's so hard to maintain all this power. Okay, and Linear has become level 46. I haven't seen lately what level the enemies are. I haven't been paying enough attention. Let's go and attack that thing. I thought I got to drop on it. Damn! Don't do that! Stop hurting Mag! What did he do to you? Punched out, like, oh, whoops. all of his brothers and sisters for the last 16, 18, 19 floors. <laughs> yeah, that's a good point. <sighs> that's a lot of floors, too. I love that the numbers on the mana bar down there where Linear's FP is, you can't even see how full it is because the number bar is completely covered up. Hey, Gray, you know that whole thing you just did? I want you to do it again. Wonderful. Big, gigantic spirit of doom. Must be able to Tai Chi, uh, Gray does in the morning. <clears throat> and somewhere in the back of the back of his mind, he's just going, oh god, oh god, please don't let me throw out my back. You know, I think he might also be thinking, oh god, oh god, please don't let this, please don't let this backfire. Mag's evasion value increased by one. 
Anything in here? Hooray, one hooray more free stuff. We found a grenades. I'm going to repeat that. We found a grenades. Okay. We will pick up a grenades. Now we have now picked up grenades. I think it's just, yep, just a thrown item. Sure, I'll just get more health. Well, at least we're getting more interesting thrown items. Yeah, on the second to last dungeon in the game. The game finally decides that, oh, I guess we're ending soon. Maybe we should throw something new at you that you haven't seen before. Nah. Yeah. Okay, we're gonna see if this next level is the final level. If it is, we're gonna fight the boss. If it isn't... Um... Then we'll do that the next episode! It never ends! It never ends! At, le the la at least the last dungeon is not randomized. The last dungeon is actually preset. So, uh... <laughs> How many floors is it? Uh, it's... It's hard to describe. We'll see when we get there. It's not so much floors. Hmm. I'm talking about the last storyline dungeon, not the last randomized one. The last randomized one is like 30 floors long. It is still randomized. Gah. And we're going to do it. Okay. What do we find up here? Nope. We are not there yet. We have found a doctor fiber. That sounds interesting. What the hell does that do? What can I drop for it? Um, let's drop the heavy tail coat for a doctor fiber. What does this do? New items! A medical suit that helps improve various abilities. Um, Mag, is that something for you? Ooh, drops... Well, that's really good, but it drops attack by a lot, so no. Uh, let's see if anybody else can wear it. it. Drops her defense by a lot. Okay, apparently Linear's wearing it. I mean, it's really good. It just, it drops the attack power of the two heavies by way too much. So, that's, you know, that's something we don't want to do. I do not want to lose damage. Oh, it, also, it appears that we're keeping up with level. Looks like they increase uh, one level per floor, and we're increasing faster than that. Hmm, well, that's good, then. Yeah, that's why you attack everything on the floor. That's exactly why you do that. There's no other reason I should do that. It's not that I'm bloodthirsty and want to hurt everything. And we're using this for catharsis. No, that's not how this works. Video games don't make you violent. Losing in video games does. <coughs> and I've been playing a lot of Risk of Rain lately, so you do the math. Oh, god damn, it's another one. There's another with the big ones over there. Don't do that to Mag. That's not very nice. This is generally the point at which I start backing away slowly. <laughs> <laughs> well, it is a big one, but luckily I get the um, I get the invincibility frames for a second after the battle, so I should be able to get behind it. Not sure though. I like this attack. I don't know why this thing has an attack like this, but I like that attack. It's a very cool attack. It's like it's lightning rotting itself and then redirecting it at you. Basically, yeah. That's pretty much what it's doing. I don't know why it does that. Couldn't tell you, but... Better question is, where's the lightning coming from? We are in the lightning ruins. Probably just a short circuit somewhere. Please tell me I got it. Nope. Okay, this is bad. Um, you know what? I'm willing to do this. I am willing to do this. I almost never use this attack because it, is, it uses way too much FP. But, under the circumstances, we're using it. Ker wham. Damn. It still did not one shot it. Uh, Gray? I, no, actually, no. You know what? No. It's fair to be. Gray has, like, no FP right now. 
which is kind of a problem. It's definitely a problem. These things are too damn big. They take too much damage. Luckily, they die. And Mag has become 47. So we're keeping up. Not by a lot, but we're keeping up. All right, there's no more enemies on this on this room. Uh, do I have a um? Thought I had a thermal. Nope. Okay. No, you used all of those already, unfortunately. Yep. That's fine, though. I mean, we don't really need it. Just would make it faster for me to find my way around the floor. To the things that matter. Oh, uh, that's an enemy. So just pop right behind him. Should I use the Brontosaurus steel, or should I wait for that for the boss? Hmm, might as well save it for the boss. We're gonna make a spectacle of it. Apparently. But it takes so it, it takes uh it takes damage away from Mag. <laughs> He's gonna get upset at me because I didn't let him kill it by himself. <laughs> <laughs> but I wanted to punch it to pieces. Gray's got level 47. He's an even scarier butler. People have told me they've gotten to level 80 on this. I would not be surprised. The, 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 few, the few bits and pieces of guides I've found trying to look this stuff up, like they start talking about how, you know, there's an optional dungeon or optional something that runs up to about, optional boss at least, that runs up to about level 73, so. That's probably the fifth dungeon. Well, not the, technically the sixth dungeon, because you do it after you do the final dungeon. But, um... I didn't think it went that high. Might be wrong, though. It's been a very long time since I've done it. Might be. I don't know. We'll see. We can go do it. It'll take 20 episodes, but... We can do it. Or we can just off-screen it and just come back to it when we get to the when we get to the boss. <laughs> when we get to the good part. When we get to the good part, when we're beating the crap out of the boss. Okay, let's see. No item in that room. It's okay, game. I don't want items, really. You shouldn't give them to me at all. What about this room? Oh, there's an item. Just one. See, it's a it's it, it's a computer. You can't reverse Upgrade psychology kit. yet. Upgrade kit. Up. Upgrade kit. Even though Mag can't use it, Mag is unable to use the upgrade kit. Hmm. He's got. He's already got. He's already got as many slots on his uh, side frame as he can get. I don't know why. Oh, that's still are. quality goodies. Yeah. Well, I'll probably give it to um, Pepper. I think. Yeah, yeah, and I know she costs money to take with you, but I've always. Just, I, I I like it. Like Pepper. She's very all or nothing, but... Yeah, she is. That's... That's the... Uh, 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 just... Everybody plays it a little differently. That's sort of... That's one of the wonders of the multiple... Uh-huh. Multiple choice party. The reason why I don't like her is she is very all or nothing. She likes to use all of her FP at once. And FP takes a while to get back. So it's just one of those... Eh... Well, I don't know. I, I, in every like game or MMO or anything else I've played, I always always end up picking the glass cannons and the the thieves and rogues. So I'm used to I'm used to sudden all or nothing spike damage. Well, I'm not gonna say I'm not, but it's one of those. She is so all or nothing. Like most of her most of her skills have you uh, just use all of her FP all at once. Which, that's one of those cases where you can just have Linear top her up again. Well, Linear has to top her up by getting rid of her own stuff, so you can only do it, like, twice. <laughs> ah, but if you do it right, twice is enough. Eh. I mean, she's really good against the final boss. I can tell you that much. But, um... I mean, that's the final boss, and at that point, <sighs> it's like there's nothing after it, so you might as well use all of your FP. <laughs> like, you're not saving it for anything, you're just, you know, you're just doing it. We got over here. There's another room right here, which has a single enemy in it. Once again, no items. God damn it. 
It had to be one of these. Good, I got the drop on it. Who does it have with it? Okay, it's only one of them, which is good. So let's kill everything else first. So I'm not going to be able to kill it before it gets a turn, unfortunately. Especially not with linear missing, like, attacks. But... The Archaeopteryx. I'm surprised you didn't just smish and then then start wailing well, on it. Mag has only... Or, 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 I, I have a feeling that this is the last floor, and I'm trying to top up, uh, top up my uh, FP to make sure that um, when I get the final boss, we actually have the PDUs. Because once you get up there, the only way to get FP back is the Volcana Ampule. Hmm. And I'd rather not have to use it like for, to top myself or to uh, refill. I'd rather use it to top myself up. So yeah, I'll want to have like over 90% FP by the time I get to there. Bad things happen otherwise. Thank you, Linear! Even though someone else is going to take a lot of damage in this turn. No, never mind, I killed it. Yay! Good! That's good! I didn't have to take more damage to that thing. The fact that they can do so much damage is kind of ridiculous. I'm I'm really hoping this is the last floor. I am too, for our sake. God damn it! Freaking thing! What designer came up with the confusion thing that t just ah? <clears throat> I can I can just picture Mag stepping on a plate in the floor, and a little little arm with a sprayer comes out, just sprays him in the eyes, and he just runs around screaming for a few minutes. If we're going that, I'm, I'm imagining the, uh, the little smacky devices from, uh... God damn, there's another one. We found a navigator. Oh, is that the really good one? I think that's the really good one. You know what? That's what we're gonna do. Nope, never mind, I'm saving that. <laughs> I'm saving the hell out of that. I think the navigator is the item that, that uh, is all of the special items in one. I think that's what that is. So that should be good. Okay, roll for initiative. Oh, he got a crit. <sighs> That's one guy basically dead. Another crit. Smack him. Just gonna spread the damage around a little bit. Kill that guy. Oh, come on. Don't do that. Don't miss, Gray. You never miss. Don't do that. I need you to hit every time. Always. You need, you need to have 100% accuracy. You're asking for 100% accuracy from an old guy with a rifle. Yes. Yes, I am. Because up until now, he's shown... Like, his accuracy has to be like 98% in the game so far. Gray just flat doesn't miss. So whenever he does miss, it's a problem. <sighs> Thing not dead. Just did 2,000 damage to my guys. That's not okay. I'm more impressed that Linear is still managing to crit on him so much. Linear has just incredible crit chance. She's up. She's got the uh, the Doctor Fiber that she picked up. Got her. Um, I think she's back up to like 60% luck. Hmm. <laughs> I think I think she is. Uh, she's so see, because that 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 kind 51. of crit chance is that kind of crit chance is really giving her like. She, she's standing next to Mag when she does that. Yeah. For damage output. I mean, you gotta remember, though, she's doing it on a crit. Like, she's not doing it naturally. Yeah, but like I said, if she, if she keeps critting like that, she'll stand next to Mag quite reliably. Not Which is kind of funny. Really. Holy moly, that hurt. Yeah. You gotta remember, Mag does 683 on a non-crit. Linear does 680, or like, like 600 on a crit. <sighs> if Mag crits, he does... He gets, he's getting close to 1,000, actually. We got a little count of ampule, which I will take over... Uh, let me drop the... Hmm, let's drop the heavy coat. I'm having to make tough decisions here. 
not like you're likely to use a lot of these pieces of equipment at this point. Well, I'm point. trying to remember. I have not. I've not given any equipment to either of uh, Chain or um, or Pepper. Pepper. Ooh, right. I hadn't thought of that. Yeah, that's important. I will. Uh, you know, I I want to make sure that if I have to use them, I have um, I have armor for them because they're you know they're gonna have nothing right now. And that's a kind of a scary proposition. Ow. Okay. We're almost done with this floor, though. Yay! Okay. Considering it's, we're at 40 minutes for this episode. Oh, God. Yeah, this episode's going to, gonna go longer because I still have enemies to kill and I haven't completely explored the floor. Close, but I'm not there yet. It just never ends. It doesn't. It never ends. Eh, you're gonna go ahead and squish this. Oh, no, it, it never ends. We're going the wrong way here. Okay. Linear has become level 48. Um, no, I'm gonna drop the herb. I don't need herbs. If it's Manalin Royal, we're talking. But an herb? No. Nope, nope, nope. What's this over here? Okay, it's one of these guys. That's cool. I might have... Do I want to have Mag Squish? No, never mind. Not on this. Not worth it. Linear, go ahead and... Serious first aid. We're doing well. We're doing really well. Okay. Everybody gets their health back. So everybody's at full health. Uh, everybody is at basically full TP. So, hopefully, the next floor is the final. And if that's the case, that boss is not going to know it hit it. Except it will. It'll know it was Max Fist. And he'll, he'll know because he's going to keep doing it. Might be hard to figure out figure it out the first time. Just what, what the hell was that? But then Mag's gonna hit it again and again and again. And by the time it sees the five finger death punch for the fifth or sixth time, it'll know. <laughs> okay, what do I got over here? I still have the bottom of the floor down there. God damn, there's more. <laughs> Holy shit, there's more. Okay, what's in this room? Another Dr. Fiber. Okay, I'm gonna actually take it. And I'll save it for one of the girls. Because, Maggot, goddammit, there's three more enemy groups. <sighs> do you have to kill them all? Yes. Yes, your I do. Your bloodlust will be your undoing. No, nope, well, my hubris will be their undoing. Haven't you been watching? But I'm gonna squish as much as I can. Wow, Mag's getting up to 400 FP now. It's like 370 is his max right now. It's kind of impressive. It means he can do like seven different, no, or six different. Um, don't want. It means he can do like six different uh, Magna Raves. I was gonna say six or seven different murder punches. Pretty much. Pretty much. But no, we want to level up as much as possible. Because, uh, I do not want life to get unpleasant. Because who knows, this dungeon may go on for ten more floors. Oh god! Oh god, no! <laughs> oh, please, no! I'm, I'll be honest, I'm actually surprised it's gone on so long. I, I was, I seriously thought floor 19 or 20 was going to be the boss floor. So the fact that we're on floor 20 with no sign of stopping... Damn it, where'd it go? There it goes. But we're all, I mean, we're almost... We're almost there. And... Mag... And... Dive Punch. But yeah, I'm basically just dive punching every enemy group, so each combat's lasting for all of 50 seconds. We're getting a crap ton of EXP and TP. 
Not that TP really matters now. Unless Mag gets some hand parts. Hint, hint, game. <laughs> I'm still holding out hope, damn it. I thought we'd managed to crush that hope. Apparently not. Okay, so... Okay, so here's this room. So this is the room I started in. So this is a damn big floor. Look at this floor. Look at this thing. This is the... God damn it. This is the biggest floor we've seen by a long ways. And we, we don't even know where the exit is. Like, this is not like some of the other floors where I was running around, I knew where the exit was, but I was just trying to beat the floor. Like, we I'm don't know where the exit is. I'm guess and say that it's probably on the top left. Probably. Because I know there's some rooms. There's a room, do you see the room to my left, right there? Yep. And there's another room above me. Okay, this is, okay, this is the exit. Found a chameleon color, I'll take it. Use an herb on mag. Okay, this is the exit, I think. Yeah, it's the exit. Okay, because the exit rooms are kind of all the same. But I know there was at least one more room up here that I want to investigate real quick. Hand parts? Nope. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to go look. We're going to see if this next floor is the floor. If it is, fantastic. If it isn't, that sucks. Actually, you know what? We're just going to end the episode. There's no point looking. I just realized, if I if I don't end the episode, we're going to go to that floor, and then it's going to be, well, I guess we'll just be sitting here and leaving the Dreamcast on for a while. That sounds like a bad idea. Yeah. We don't want to do that. Because sudden power outages are uh, totally a thing. And that would suck. No! No! no damn it! So how's your weekend going? <laughs> <laughs> it seems to be drawing out, drawing itself out a little bit. <laughs> Just a little bit. Uh, okay, we're gonna go. Okay, guys, it's been a pleasure having you for this. <laughs> God damn it! <laughs> oh God! <laughs> it puts you on the other side. Of the it map. puts you on the entire other side of the map. Come on! It's official. At this point, the game's just the game kicking is with you. The game me. Because it's like, wait, we can't kill him. We can't stop him. <laughs> Quick, let's troll him. So yeah, guys, I'm so glad to have had you for this extra length uh, episode of Ow Let's Play Evolution. I hope to see you guys soon, where we will hopefully be fighting the boss on the very next floor. Hopefully. I hope. We'll see you later.